guys welcome to my channel so this out i made these beautiful perfume bottle frames these are just frames from wheelcos that i had laying around and i wanted to do something with them and i went ahead and printed out some um chanel perfume bottles and a dior perfume bottle and i'm going to be sticking them in the frames I'm going to be working on these two first and I'm going to use some Elmer's glitter glue and then I've got some fine just some fine glitter and I'm going to mix that up in a little shot glass that I'll get and obviously you'll need a paintbrush to paint it on I will be painting straight on to the glass with the glitter glue combo And then I'm going to be picking out some details on the picture and I'm going to be painting on the glitter glue, um, just capturing the details straight onto the glass. This doesn't come off guys, um, it's quite durable this glue and it just picks out some of the details and makes it look pretty. Now you can do this with any picture you want, it hasn't got to be a perfume bottle but I just like the um, look of it as you can see i've um picked out all the details in the bottles i've left the top of the bottles the lid of the bottles free because i'm going to be sticking some stuff on there but yeah this is how they came out and now i've just got some foam roses and some feathers and this is what I'm going to be using to stick on and decorate the top of the um, perfume lids um, I do show another glue a Gorilla Glue but I do end up using my glue gun as it was quicker and easier As you can see, I've got the glue gun plugged in and ready to go. And I'm going to be sticking the roses just on the lid of the perfume bottle. It's just nice and simple and it gives a really good look. Obviously be really careful because this is hot glue and I did burn myself quite a few times doing this so just be aware that it is it's really hot it's hot glue.
as you can see I'm now wearing a plaster on my finger as I did burn myself quite bad on my glue gun but I'm now going to be sticking on some feathers here there and everywhere just on top of the perfume lid with the roses just to make it a bit more glam Now I've done all the feathers, I'm going to be taking some little um, just little gemstones, a bit of bling, and I'm going to put them in the centre of the flowers. The little heart shapes are really cute and I thought they looked really nice. So that's what I'm doing now. And this is what it looks like close up. How beautiful does this look? these are some more frames that i had and i decided to do two more bigger ones um i just add these laying around um at the time i am crafting up my dining room table but the steps are just the same i'm gonna be glittering the um details on this and then i do introduce some um scatter crystals uh which will probably come into frame in a moment here we are these are the scatter scatter crystals um you can find them on ebay they're like table confetti but silvered back so i'm going to be sticking some of these just in the bow i'm not going to put, be putting any um any flowers on i'll just glitter the lid and i'll just uh, give it a different look i really don't want you to get any cake here but these are some of the footage obviously it's come out the wrong way when i was filming but these is what they look like close up um, I think they look absolutely stunning. Great for a present for anyone. Really easy to make. Um, I just put them on my mantelpiece here just to show you guys what they're like. So yeah, if you like this video, please um, subscribe. This is my new channel. Um, leave me a comment and like. And thank you guys.